Stage mom energy. You gave her the nastiest spot you ever. No, did you actually? Um, who do I see? Literally Darth Vader. It's not us. No. It's 8.30 in the morning. No, they would let me die. Look how, look how you guys look right now. What would you do? I don't even say that. I'm water! I was fun to actually me, Vader. <laughs> we look great. Thanks. <laughs> um, hmm. So, good morning. This is going to be the start of a college week in my life vlog. My last week of college ever because I'm graduating. I'm going to be honest, we're off to the best start. I had a 9.05 this morning and I overslept. Today's exciting because we have our grad photos and we have a lot of errands to run. So I'm going to get out of bed, shower, make breakfast slash lunch, go run all my errands, nails done, spray tan, do some homework. <laughs> bottom half of me looks like I'm going to play like D3 lacrosse at a school in Florida. Not that UF is D3, but the whole like athlete chain combos sending me. Post shower, did not wash my hair because we're gonna wash it and blow dry it later. I just needed to shave and exfoliate for my spray tan. Okay, so fake little Olaplex bun. Cause I like having a wet slick back hair when I get my tan. My hairline isn't really affected. Is that perfect? No, but it's going to do the job. Um, now I'm going to make a sandwich to eat really fast because I'm also fasting on my groceries because I'm leaving for the beach on Friday and I haven't grocery shopped in like two and a half weeks. So quite literally all I have to my name is two tablespoons of tzatziki, some pita, a grilled chicken last night, maybe some lettuce if we're lucky and anything that I have in the freezer. Slim pickings. Today's video is sponsored by Albert. So the question of the hour is, what's Albert? Albert is a personal finance app used by over 10 million people. Get your paychecks faster. Instant cash, cash back. Get paid early. Budget and save automatically and invest your cash. Grow your money. Stocks, the good stuff. Say you're about to overdraft, they'll spot you up to $250, no questions asked. They have your back. But of course, there's more. I'm coming to you live from post-grad life. I've been traveling for about a month now and we're hitting the point that I wish I had spent less money at the beginning so I wouldn't feel as bad about spending money now. Financial literacy and just finances in general is something you talk about a ton post-grad and just generally all the time in college, everyone's talking about career path advice, money, how much you're going to be making you start learning how much it costs to truly just exist in terms of rent groceries like literally everything the last financial literacy course i took personally was literally a junior in high school and i took econ and to be honest i didn't even really pay attention so lacking the information that i truly could be needing basically you download the app the coolest feature that i think personally about albert is the genius live ask professionals questions about your finances. What should I be doing? What are the trends? We're talking increasing credit scores. We're talking paying off debt. We're talking payment plans, all of the good stuff. Something that can cause a lot of stress is nice to be relaxed and talking someone through all of your worries and stresses and fears and feeling comfortable and confident about your financial decisions. And free to download and also free to check out. So if you even have questions about any of these things, download the app through it, schedule a Genius Live section and get your questions answered because it's better to know than always to wonder. I will have a link in the description if you guys are interested in downloading Albert, increase your financial literacy and ask questions about your finances and get hip to these things because it's so important. But other than that, enjoy the vlog. Yeah. Allegedly, I have my grad photos at 5.30, but the wind is absolutely insane. So my photographer, Chris, texted me and said that we might reschedule for Friday morning at 6.30 in the morning because the wind advisory is just really aggressive and that means like dress flying up, hair flying everywhere, like 
there would be some malfunctions. That makes my life infinitely more stressful because of everything I have going on on Friday, but if it means better grad photos, then I'm obviously down with it. It just kind of messed up my like hair, tan, whatever schedule, but we're gonna find out in 30 minutes if he thinks it's a better call to do that. I'm gonna get some coffee right now because if I'm not in a huge rush now to get all ready, then I might as well be caffeinated and take my time, but I'm still on the wave of the ice dopio espresso with a pump of white chocolate and sweet cream cold foam. I've been drinking this since quarantine because I saw someone on TikTok do it and it's a cheaper way to have a latte. Hi, can I please have an ice dopio espresso in a grande cup? Can I do a pump of white chocolate in that and then sweet cream cold foam on top? Yeah, the white chocolate and mocha, we are sold out of did not make it to the cereal on a truck. We do have mocha, wow. okay. vanilla, we have caramel. Hmm, what do you think I should do? The people who have been falling back to vanilla, that's the closest thing we're gonna have to a white mocha flavor. It's funny, I did this yesterday and I got the vanilla and it was okay, so I, I feel like I need to do something different this time. You can always make it like a French vanilla, like vanilla and coffee nut. Oh, heck yeah, do that. That sounds awesome. <laughs> okay, thank you, yay. Okay, that should be really fun. That sign's actually fucking ama amazing. So whoever this man is, he's on his shit. Oh my God, this is my king right here. Everyone has been so, every service worker has been so nice to me recently. Is that for you? Thank you so much. Have a go. You too. All right, we got it back secured. Looks like this is pretty standard for the iced Jopio espresso. We're gonna actually focus on driving for a second here. Ow, 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 ow. Okay, so we're sampling this because we're at a stoplight. I take this, mix it all up. This could be a game changer or it could be average. Woo, oh my God. He's like wedding cake. Here's my semester at sea stole. I'm not gonna put it on because of my self tanner, but my mom did it for me and put on all the patches of all the 12 that I went to. She's perfect. So as you can see, my tan is developing. So I'm gonna sit and paint my toenails right now while I'm watching the new episode of Moon Knight because it's Wednesday and it just came out. And Chris should text me in the next 30 minutes, 15 really, if we're gonna continue to do the photos today or move them to Friday because I just went outside like coming into my apartment um, and was trapped in a tornado. So I'm thinking we might push it, but I'm gonna paint my toes this pink color. Loki is symbolic. If you've been watching me since like, you know, since I started college, I always go home when I visit and paint my toes this pink color because they match the color of my shower shoes when I came to college. Um, so the last pedicure that I got with my mom before I started at Tech was pretty much this exact same shade of pink and we always joked, you know, shower shoes, big inside thing, nostalgic. JK, we're going to get Chipotle. Hey. Not the apartment numbers. <laughs> Look who it is. I'm not saying cheese because I'm stressed. We're going to Chipotle. Do you want to come? Get in the car. I don't know where to park. Do you want me to park my car? Yeah. Just park. There's a spot right there. Okay. Look at this. Look at this. <gasps> Woo! Woo! Baby, a salty. Oh, man. Oh, man. Mm-hmm. And my dad came home and was like, what the fuck? And then my dad made him move. And then he just fell asleep in my dad's office chair. <laughs> really? I had a dream that I was stuck in Maddie's room and I couldn't get out. I had a dream that I was getting killed by Michael from, or sorry, sorry Jason. <laughs> from Friday the 13th, so mm -hmm. everyone fuck off. Good morning, I just woke up. I'm about to shower because this tan is just like way darker than normal. And I was gonna wait to shower until my actual grad photo's morning. But like if I wanna go in public and like do things, I feel so busted. And I need to film TikToks for Ozzy today and my hair is disgusting. So we're gonna shower and blow dry our hair and get all ready for the day. And we have a few things that are going on today just to get out of the way before we leave to go to the beach tomorrow. So we're having a very busy checking the boxes kind of day. Okay, I showered, did some homework right here, and now I'm going to go meet my friends, G Little, because she's interviewing me for a project. So we're going to Starbucks, and I got the same drink that I got yesterday. I already started posting about it, and I had people try it, and so I've called it the wedding cake coffee, um, because it's delicious. I have to go get some emergency groceries because I literally ate leftover chicken from last night for breakfast, fried chicken at 10 a.m. Some white shorts, one of my tech sweatshirts from literally freshman year, um, my Air Force Ones. I dubbed that the depression pile because whenever I get overwhelmed and my hamper is obviously full in there, everything starts piling up. This is a combination of eBay purchases, PR, laundry from home, return slash grad pile, my cowboy hat. Um, we're going to deal with this later because we're going to have to pack for Myrtle Beach.
think Maddie's date has requested <laughs> Jim Bean vanilla. I don't feel safe. It's kind of good. Apple. Finished my interview and now we're um, Myrtle Beach alcohol shopping. Yay. Let's look at this one. Okay. <laughs> Williams brandy with pear in. I'm not gonna lie, I thought it was one of those snakes. Okay, so this is an update on my Depeef application. So they told us we would find out the first week or two of April. And Emma and I have been refreshing like literally our emails. It's the first thing I do in the morning is wake up, refresh the email. And they emailed us today and said that all candidates will receive results, including those who are placed on the wait list as well as those whose applications have not been retained. Thank you all for your patience in awaiting these results. Administrative delays beyond the program's control prevented us from releasing them sooner. Oh my holy f That- Okay, so now I'm taking the two bouquets that I got and turning them into like three and then wrapping them in newspaper. All we have is like literal ads. So this is kind of ugly. We have to leave in literally 10 minutes. Ta-da! Okay, now we're gonna go to Ingalls and then walk to the theater and see the show. Enjoy your dinner, I'll see you later when I get back. Nope, okay, I'll see you then. We have our flowers all ready to go. Um, it's Lena and Anna's senior dance performance and Breezy's also performing, so I have all of this. I look so fancy, I love it. Stage mom energy. not on time. I severe, I, I just got up 30 minutes late. This is gonna be interesting. Surprisingly, I'm not even that tired because I feel like I didn't even enter REM sleep. I don't know, I feel like I don't even look that tired either. Um, So yesterday I went to Lena and Anna and Breezy's grad show. It was Lena and Anna's senior show and it was so much fun. I went downtown after for a little bit to say hi to some friends, but I was just not in the mood and I had a lot of work to do. So I went home and then I ended up talking to my roommates and I also packed for the beach and I went to it at like 1.30. So the alarm going off at five was a little bit brutal. My biggest concern right now is that my face is puffy. So I've been using my ice roller recently. This thing is amazing. Something's a little bit wrong with it because like you're gonna hear in a second. Yeah, it's got the squeaks a little bit. I need my hair to dry a little bit more. I did not get done as much work as I probably should have yesterday because I enjoyed it being with my friends and their families after the show. So I have to make that up in the car. But Myrtle Beach is five hours, so I think that I can work on my laptop because I have a project due at three. Um, not to mention that a life-altering decision for me comes out in the, tomorrow afternoon. Semester at Sea Stole. <laughs> I like it, all the flags. I know, they just look so decorated and like fancy. Okay, now we're attempting the champagne, which I don't think I'm gonna be very good at. <laughs> I 
I just finished up Burris. You're gonna meet Chris. This is my photographer. Howdy. Banger after banger. <laughs> I'm literally an idiot. The practice field for our second bottle of champagne. I have my varsity jacket. This is from eBay. Everyone does like jerseys. I'm not really like a jersey girly. So, jacket. Brandon and Claire. <laughs> Are you guys yeah. done? No, we're taking jersey picks. Okay. <gasps> yes! Okay, wait. We're doing a smoke grenade. I just finished grad photos with the Chris, which was so good. I'm so excited, but I'm going straight to my 905. It's 901 because I'm presenting today. So, get on the go. <laughs> finished our last evolutionary neuroscience class. It's like, gave I us a little her, graduation. I gave her the nastiest spot eval ever. No, did you actually? I, did, yeah. I can't put this in. That's like slander. <laughs> <laughs> Hi guys, so it is Tuesday. I survived a weekend at Myrtle Beach and it's our official last week of classes. Like last week was a full last week, but now it's like the last like true days of classes before exam starts. Um, I already woke up this morning, went to class. My camera was dead, so I didn't vlog anything, but it was cut short anyways because we were just doing review stuff. But this morning I'm going to be making my breakfast tacos and sharing the recipe because keep getting DMs on Instagram. I've become a breakfast taco girly recently. I never will stray from avocado toast with honey and eggs, but the tacos are a good alternative and of course there's honey and avocado on them anyways so I'm gonna go show you how I make them because it's very specific and they're very good and I also largely made it up so breakfast tacos Starbucks because all the screws in the back of the camera fell off so I have had to tape the thing to it so if it's not like exactly up I can't it's not gonna be normal Matt and I were just talking about how we're in disbelief that we've been here for four years and have no boyfriend none of us have boyfriends and we we're trying to quantify this by explaining why we think we have no boyfriends um, and we've determined that it's because we go to Virginia Tech it's not us no mm -mm. Um, <laughs> let's talk about Texas. <laughs> no. Where's the Texas vlog? I haven't posted this vlog yet because I'm going to be doing a segment from last year where I post like mini episodes of vlogs because they're not full vlogs but they're like little episodes. And last summer we went to Texas to visit Maddie's now ex-boyfriend and we basically partied with the military for two days. Yeah. In San Antonio. San Antonio. Don't ever go to San Antonio. Don't ever go. To be fair, we are blocked by the majority of them at this point. <laughs> I don't know why though. Oh, this is my newest invention at Starbucks. I've called it wedding cake coffee. Blacksburg had a white chocolate mocha shortage. It was tragic, but it tastes like wedding cake. I like it in this area. That's where I lived sophomore year when I was incredibly severely depressed.
Okay, so I just finished getting ready because I'm filming festival TikToks for Ozzy. Um, the sunburn killing. This is a look that I had drafted for Paris in Christmas, but it got too cold. I found these are not pin, what are they called? Paper clips? These are safety pins. I found this picture on Pinterest. I'm gonna try to recreate this for obviously this TikTok. A little scared. I had to traverse all the way to the next town over to find these because apparently CBS and Blacksburg's been sold out of paper clips for months they said which is crazy to me but while i was getting dressed i was like loki i should just shoot some photos in this because it's giving kind of like met gala heavenly body so we're gonna go see if we can take some self timers in our bathroom because that as you guys know is one of my favorite things to do and then film this tiktok series <laughs> made really good dinner i made buffalo chicken garlic broccoli and then a nice little caesar salad action it was delicious so we're gonna shoot some photos and then do some homework filming my TikToks and Lindsay's going to work at 10 p.m. Yay, work till 6 a.m. <laughs> Lindsay's on Christiansburg Rescue. Can't say anything because of HIPAA, but um, our roommate's a volunteer EMT, so that means when any of us are close to death. What? Oh, on staff EMT. Volunteer. On staff, on staff, on staff, making money. So when any of us are close to death, um, yeah. Not you though, Emma. <laughs> I'll save Laura though. What use would that be? <laughs> so if two of us were dying and do not, do not, and you could only do save not put one. My room in the vlog. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Oh, what did I do? <gasps> do you want a haul? Can I answer the question? <laughs> Why am I going down? Oh, I was asking if, if Lindsay could, had to save so one of us. So we were in a car wreck and everyone was critically ill. Like she's asking me who I would save. And she's saying me. No, I she said at first she said Laura. <laughs> no, Lindsay would save herself. No. To be honest. No, she, they would let me die. I would be saving all of you guys. Well, you'd already be well, dead. I'm good in a crisis. <gasps> what would you do? I. Don't even say that. This seems unfair. I am CPR certified. Can Maddie and I pose for a thumbnail? Wait, so, <laughs> <laughs> so who would you save? Yeah, Should guys. My hair looks. You better answer this very wisely. Well, Harry Styles didn't even go to Met Gala, so he's. Yeah. Who would you save? He's benched. Who would I save? Wait, can you bleep right. this out? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Bottom of the tier. <laughs> Okay, it's Wednesday now. I'm heading to my last day of class ever officially. Presentation in Sandy Hall, which is a neuroscience building. It's 8.30 in the morning. Okay, this is my project. And that is all. Paul, who is that? We call him mom. <laughs> Look how, look how you guys look right now. Please don't. Are y'all trying to play? Yeah. Yes. Hey, blow bubbles, my faves. <laughs> what are your thoughts? <laughs> Frank and I just went to the hokey fair. Um, yeah, okay, we're, give a haul. We're so, gonna give a haul. All right, so some condoms. Yeah, no, straight. We have to, you know, be safe. Played a little game, and so. We won and we got to grab like some rubber duckies. This one's a doctor, kind of like that one. Kind of like us. Kind of like us, yeah. <laughs> we got our magic bubble ones. <laughs> <Woo! laughs> I have something to give you. They said to give this to someone <gasps> who vapes. Oh my God, <laughs> it's gonna be <laughs> So I'm sitting here waiting for my bus to come. Frank already left and it's May the 4th granted um who do i see you'll never guess literally darth vader we look great thanks <laughs> good morning it's when thursday get ready for grad photos round two because we're doing chapter wide zeta photos i'm drafting a new grad dress now that i'm wearing it i kind of wish i had worn it for mine I know that I couldn't because it would have been really hot because it's like beaded. It's really cool though. It's from Altered State. Kind of wedding vibes, kind of not. This is what it looks like. I'm taking this photo and then I have my School of Neuroscience photo at 11. And then I think we're going to brunch somewhere in between that. No idea. And then today we're seeing Multiverse of Madness with Briscoe at 3 p.m. And then getting margaritas. This is an ideal day. I was financially spoiled from Zeta.
Okay, I just finished a meeting with something for a campaign where I had to like access I had to access my Facebook and Instagram insights and share them with them like as a brand partner I do that a ton, but for some reason it wasn't working So I had to have a meeting about it share my screen and fix that I'm seeing multiverse of madness at three So I have like an hour not even and I'm gonna make a sandwich and then change and then we're going to see multiverse of madness which is it's gonna be insane. I'm literally so excited. We're going with Briscoe, Caro, and our friend Tommy.